Steve Arcus, internationally renowned superheroes. We are all familiar with their contributions to society. But never before has a documentary entered Steve Arcus so passionately. Many have wondered how Steve Arcus first formed, what goes on behind the camera, and for the first time ever, a documentary exposes the truth behind the infamous dark years. The world was changing, the crime rate was way up. And as a result, Steve Arcus's picnic time had plummeted to an all-time low. And where were the local superheroes? Fortunately, a new superhero team emerged at a time where darkness filled the hearts of civilians. How Steve Arcus formed is no longer a mystery. Hello sir, would you like to form a super team? Eh. High five. Okay. That day, things changed. I did, but you never saw me vote. No, I... <laughs> it is a silent, it's a silent room. to obtain this exclusive interview footage of Steve Arcus inside their own home. Now you guys are internationally renowned superheroes, what are the sorts of questions people ask you when they stop you on the street? Well, people always stop us on the street and ask us questions now. Yeah. Yeah. So why do you guys want to become superheroes? No, it's funny, people always stop us on the street and ask us that. And the short answer is, the world needed saving. Yeah. I guess we need saving ourselves. <laughs> Sa saving from what, may I ask? Um, saving from our own... Personal demons. That's deep. But even though we're famous... Wait, super. Famous. We don't let it go to our heads, you know. We're just normal guys, really. We like Average cooking, drives. baking, karaoke as much as the next guy. We even attend weekly ballet classes to keep our, you know, physical stature at peak. But for all the good times. All of a sudden, there was all this pressure, wasn't there? It's like, I would pull this knife out of my back, or stabbed, or don't attack me, he's the bad guy. Yeah. Just got to a crazy point and we were looking for an escape from it. You know, we were taking on so many cases that we barely had any time for Steve Arcus. We, we even had to, you know, stop our ballet, our weekly ballet lessons, and our superhero figures completely diminished. Yeah. Once that happened, we were really embarrassed. We didn't want to be seen by anyone, so we jumped off the radar for a while. And that's when the drinking began. Drinking? It started off as just a little nip, but then it became something so much more. Yeah. Yeah. We became a friend. Really. Mm. We managed to obtain this rare, disturbing footage of some of Steve Arcus's bad times. I thought we could win the money we lost to drinking if we started gambling, so we started hitting the poker tables. Steve was so out of control, he even sold his half of our friendship necklace. Although, Marx was never, was never really good at poker, so... It's a difficult, it's a difficult game, some people win this. We had to find other ways for him to make our money back.
Wow. It's like really dark times. Thank you for sharing that with us. I know it couldn't have been easy, but how did you overcome these dark times? Well, when our dear acquaintance, Kelton, was viciously kidnapped, beaten, basically tortured, wasn't it? <laughs> well, it was, it was time we opened our eyes and we realized that Kelton needed us, hell, even our friends needed us. And the city needed us. Yeah. So, we decided to quit the demon drink, let's get back on our feet, so to speak. Mm. So... What does the future hold for Steve Arcus? <laughs> you may as well go ask a bunch of criminals what the future holds for them. Because, you know, like, wherever they are, we'll be there. Because we hate crime. So and any, stop them. And any crime-related activities we're not fond of either. Well, I hope that answered some unanswerable questions about the world's most mysterious superheroes. And remember, viewers, wherever danger's afoot, Steve Arcus will be there. Because saving the world is Steve Arcus' middle name. Steve Arcus, Steve Arcus, Steve Arcus, Steve Arcus, fighting crime all the time. We we'll save the world. We'll get a girl, just one girl. Don't break the law. We'll break your jaw. We'll break your jaw. Steve Arcus! Steve Arcus! Steve Arcus! Steve Arcus! Steve Arcus! Oh, I thought we were.